this is my data by using this data I can draw the graph mm, I can draw the graph for that just click on the origin so if you open the origin only two columns will be appearing here if you want to increase the columns just click on here add new columns button ok now coming to the how to add the data in this before going to the um, before going to draw the graphs just first of all we have to add the data uh, for adding the data uh, there are so many ways to adding the data so one way is just copy and copy the data and paste the data just uh, so, so control e control c and so now come to the so control v so just pasting like this so pasting like this means um, so that data is not appearing correctly so so that's why what we will do means just delete this okay we can add so many buttons here now coming to the just go to the file file menu and click on import click on import and select in that single ASCII single ASCII ok so in that re, uh, so just open the what a file so just click on the file so please select here all files otherwise if you will select the only data files means that uh, ASCII files are not open so my data is in ASCII file so as, uh, if you click the test files also that is not appearing so that's why we have to select all files here so then only ASCII files will be up here click on the ASCII file so select open see here so the data is um, automatically updated automatically updated here so uh, this is the tooth so this is the XRD data so that's why so access access is in two theta and y axis is intensity intensity so see here this is a column and this is b column so here a also y axis b also in y axis so just uh, double click on the yeah, axis we have to change the that axis x axis so select the x and click apply ok now coming to the so this is x axis this also x axis if you see here so this is the data ok so if you write the comment uh, units here you can uh, so you can write you can write or not so the units here okay so two theta in it is here degree and in tensity is units so in xrd we can take intensity units are counts c o counts comments so instead of comments here we can write the sample name so sample name here this is the sample name is x let us take okay if you select the data so click on the plot menu so go to the plot menu click on the plot menu here so many graphs will be up here so line graphs symbols so line plus symbols so many graphs will be up here otherwise so just just go to the this shortcut menu just click on the shortcut menu ok so this is a XRD single ASCII files XRD of the single ASCII file suppose if you want to select the more than uh, one ASCII file means so just go to the file menu and click on import and click on multi ASCII files so multi ASCII files here so uh, here I am adding two, three files by by using control button we can click the we can add the we can we can select the three files here so after selecting the files just click on add suppose if you want to remove the files means just click on uh, selected file and click click the remove remove button here ok so here I am selecting three files just click on ok
menu just so here there is a replacing button uh, replace existing data is there just and that uh, so st start new books start new sheets start new columns button is there just select the start new columns so why because means so all data will be all data uh, will be appearing only one sheet so that is better okay now click on okay see here all data is appearing in one sheet okay so for uh, here okay this is the old data so these two are the old data these three are the new data values so we can delete this old data so delete here okay so similarly mm, I, this is the two theta and intensity okay just select control c so we can write units also degree and intensity what is the so here xrd we can take counts okay now just select this and copy and paste here also here also because these also two theta values and these are also two theta values and uh, now coming to the so this is the sample name we have to write the sample name here and here so this uh, this sample for this data sample name is x let us take x similarly x so this data is y so y similarly y y and 2 theta is in x axis 2 theta value is in x axis d value is in y axis just double click on uh, in this column if you double click the on that column so what happened so here one menu will be appear in that menu you can change the x axis so we can change the uh, we can write the name uh, here also 2 theta degree units so comments you can write here also so column width column width you can increase the column width suppose if you want to increase the column width so just click 9 so if you click the 9 means it will be increases okay apply so similarly if you will take x apply sorry any selected so all are selected here so just uh, click on only x so this is the y so this is the x and this is the okay now coming to the so all two theta values are in x axis intensity is in y axis see here okay now coming to just select all data and click on this button so see here all graphs are um, that means overlapping with each other overlapping with each other means so nearly all are uh, overlapping here so that's why so what we have to do means we have to stack the uh, you can select the all data you can select the all data and just so click on in this button so here so many lines with so many graphs we appearing here so just uh, for go to the stack stack button means if you select the stack button so what happened so that lines will be up here mm, that means uh, different graph this is the x sample graph y sample graph z sample graphs are so appears like this okay this is the uh, just here click on auto preview so if you click on auto preview means so that uh, preview will be up here okay so click on ok so this is the graph now coming to the uh, otherwise we can so we can draw like these graphs another way so just click on 
stat lines by y offset so like this if you draw the graphs like this offset y values so so these y values are not x exact values because these are the offset uh, offset values so that's why so we can delete this y, y values so we can write here arbitrary units so this intensity is in arbitrary units okay similarly by using uh, import similarly by using here excel files excel files also so we can upload similar 